Before she went into hiding, Anne had started collecting postcards and pictures of movie stars. In May 1939, she wrote to her American pen pal, Juanita, that her collecting picture cards numbered around 800. She brought her collection with her to the secret annex. She's one of the most influential, widely read writers of the 20th century, and she never lived to see her book in print, or even to see her 16th birthday. We're talking about Anne Frank, a symbol of resilience and lost innocence in the face of the Holocaust. Anne Frank was born in 1929 in Frankfurt, Germany, the youngest daughter of a Jewish family. Hitler and his anti-Semitic Nazi party rose to power in 1933, and so the Frank family moved to the more tolerant city of Amsterdam in the Netherlands. In June of 1940, the Netherlands was invaded by Germany, and conditions for people there, especially Jews, began to deteriorate. The Franks tried to leave for the U.S., but were blocked from doing so by restrictive immigration policies. Later, on her 13th birthday, Anne received a simple present that would have enormous historical repercussions. It was a blank diary. In it, Anne chronicled her thoughts and feelings, writing about her family and friends and boys, all the kind of things you might expect from a young teenage girl. As Anne began her diary, the situation in occupied Netherlands worsened. Jews were stripped of their rights, forbidden from attending schools, from shopping at most stores, and from taking public transportation. They were subject to a curfew, and they were being sent to work in camps.